which means you can have either the worst life on planet earth or the best life that any human has ever experienced both of them you can create based on what you place in front of the mirror hello my brothers and sisters imagine that i am your elder sister now most of you are probably much older to me but for this video just imagine i'm your elder sister and you've come to me for some family advice on how to change a negative reality into a positive reality now if this topic is for you whip out your notebook and your pen because class is about to begin hello everyone my name is kartika nayar i'm a coach and trainer but for today i'm playing the role of your elder sister this is a topic that you requested so i want to speak to you one heart to another heart you're ready let's get started so my advice to you starts with understanding that the entire world around you outside of you is a giant mirror that means all the people in your life all of what they're doing to you all the different circumstances and situations in your life is in nothing but a mirror which means there's nothing outside of you except just a three dimensional mirror so our work is not outside at all so if your life is a mirror then what is there inside of you that is causing it to show a negative reality the answer is not out there but it's actually closer to home your answer is in your feelings in your emotions the pain that you feel right now about your situation the powerlessness the victimhood feeling smaller feeling like it's the divine's wish and that you are absolutely out of control feeling like life is just left to chance all of these things emit an energy signature in simple words all of these feelings are responsible for mirroring the negative reality into your life these feelings are your manifestation energy which means you manifest the exact situations that make you feel more powerless more like a victim feel smaller feel like the divine has its own wish and that you are absolutely out of control in that you you feel like your life is left to chance now if any of you had a aha moment right now i want you to comment in the comment section by affirming that it's just a mirror life is just a mirror go ahead and type it down life is just a mirror so what's the good news the good news brothers and sisters is that since life is just a mirror you become the creator which means when you change your emotions about life your energy signature changes and when your energy changes even the people the situations the circumstances they all begin to change the reflection changes when you change which means you can have either the worst life on planet earth or the best life that any human has ever experienced both of them you can create based on what you place in front of the mirror So how do we change our emotions about our life when all kinds of crazy nonsense is happening in our life how do we stop ourselves from feeling those negative powerless emotions the answer is pretty simple but first do not spiritually bypass brothers and sisters it is so important for me to tell you do not spiritually bypass spiritual bypassing is where you're just positively thinking but ignoring the pain that you're feeling this does no good it's like you have all these dead rats in your house and you don't like the smell of the dead rats so you brush it under the carpet and just spray a ton of perfume in your house temporarily the perfume will smell amazing you'll feel really really good but very soon the stench of the dead rats will start rising up and then overwhelming you again which in simple words is no amount of positive thinking without healing yourself will create a long term successful life why because you're doing positive thinking but suddenly the pain creeps up again how many of you understand what i'm saying just type in the comments saying it's just a mirror okay type it again it's just a mirror you're doing positive thinking you're doing everything but then bam again negative reality negative emotions powerlessness victimhood smallness if you don't heal this the mirror does not change so i would not advise you to go from negative feeling to jump up to positive feeling because the vibrations are too too far apart for you to feel really good when you're so smashed out of life you must go from negative emotions to peace okay it's called the neutral state you can't jump it it's like going from 
step one all the way to step 10 you will stumble you won't be able to do it right but you need to take one step at a time so when you can neutralize your emotions you can peace out you can relax you can observe that pain powerlessness and neutralize it when you can do that the next step is positive thinking so it is negative emotions peace positive emotions it's not negative to positive you have to neutralize that negative charge and then jump to positive. So to neutralize the negative charge, what I would recommend are two practices. You can do either one of them. One is called Ho'oponopono. I have a very detailed playlist for you in my description section. Just go ahead, study it and apply it. The second one is what I personally use. This one is called mindfulness. To me, this is for me the most ultimate practice. There is a playlist for that as well in the description. Uh, also, I always do classes on mindfulness. So the upcoming class is on the coming, not this Sunday, but the next Sunday, the 18th at 4.30 p.m. Indian Standard Time. You can register for that. It's a free class in the description box. What am I teaching you in this class is very simple. How to be calm no matter what is going on in your life because this will change the mirror, right? How to heal yourself of any negative emotions that you're going through this will change the mirror and how to create the life that you truly deserve to live through this practice of mindfulness. I have that class coming up on the 18th. You can register for it in the description box. So we know how to neutralize ourselves. Now, how do we go from peace, calm to the positive side? Do any positive practice. You can do affirmations. You can do pivoting. I have a video on that. I'll put that in the description as well. You can do anything positive. Any law of attraction stuff will get you there. But before you try to do law of attraction stuff, if you don't heal yourself, then it's just going to keep coming back in the form of more negative situations and more complications in your life. Anybody understanding what I'm saying, just please give me a confirmation by telling me in the comments. I absolutely understand you and that brings me to the end of my elder sister talk with you guys i hope you could feel my love and vibes for all of you i give you a big hug that no matter what you're going through in your life my friends my lovely family i want you to know that this too shall pass nothing is permanent and everything works out and if it hasn't it's not yet the end and you have all the space and time to heal yourself and to shift your vibration so you're always 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 free you're always given opportunities and you always are in power no matter what your mind tells you i hope that you got something back please go ahead and comment in the comment section what are your lessons from today's video from this elder sister talk that we're doing and hopefully you have at least three things to take back please comment below so i have a confirmation that my tribe is learning something of value here so go ahead and type it down and i look forward to seeing you tomorrow for another video i love you all and i look forward to seeing you very very soon namaste